you wouldn't use the lightning thing around this guy because if that thing works in the if that thing can strike through the bedrock in the nether it can strike him right there minecraft it really can't it has to be visible to the sky by base minecraft qualities of course Fat bastards came lobbing right on out of there. I don't know how they're getting out of there. Jumping this probably. Those jumpy slimes I've ever seen. Yeah, I just saw like three of them spout out of there like like it was a firework. It's future gonna spawn some more. Get in there and piss it off really well. No, he's pissed at me apparently. Come on, motherfucker, I'm standing right in front of you. Hit me! Nope, oh, he's mad at me still. Nope. I don't know what I picked up. That hurts. Yes, it does. Got any food? I guess we're all gonna starve. No, you'll starve. You'll starve. Because no. I'm going to eat you. Now you'll starve. <laughs> oh, look! Two more just spawned. Where? They were here. Hey buddy, how it going? Let me just put my head up in there in the same space as you. Is he mad at you? Yeah. Sure, you should run into him. Another stone sword. Sulfur. You got sulfur. I guess I got some sulfur too. It would be funny if, like, you logged out or something. Or just walked away from here. While I'm standing Why? right here. Nothing. You're very susceptible to withering, aren't you? Apparently. You just have a bite of your toes. I'll feel so much better with just one bite. <laughs> what? It's just, it's just so funny. Every time you look in and get all weird, I just slap you with the sword, and you just fall into non-existence. I could grab a tar slime, by the way. Why? Put a tar slime in here. It's a head. Let's go. There, there's the head. Okay. Teleport to the wither room. Do you got soul sand on you? Uh, Let me run home and then teleport to the wither room. Okay. I'm waiting in the wither room. That would suck. If we didn't have any soul sand. Are you sure? Are you sure we do? Hey, dumbass. It's dark in here. Yes, of course it's dark, Charlie. I need light to be able to place this. Oh, I got a torch. You had to build this unevenly, huh? Yeah. 
Bowser just to ensure the fuck doesn't escape. Okay, as soon as he spawns, back up, let his explosion go. Because he's surrounded with water and obsidian, it's guaranteed not to destroy everything. Pretty sure that's not true. Back up! Seal it up, you better seal that. Shit, we can't get out of here, can we? At least place one block. Oh, look, yeah, you can't get up. Let me kill him, let me kill him. I got beheading. Maybe I'll get his head. <laughs> Woo! Wither head! You get the cube? I got it right here. Okay, then, good. We got a cube. Now <laughs> I got a head. Just now we can just start condensing uh, wither stars and we don't have to worry about this shit. Let's teleport out. But I want to keep fighting you. Well, do you have enough heads? No, that's said later on. Like, I just want to keep fighting him. Like, I want to keep that bitch over there to farm and bullshit. Right. But yeah, I told you it worked. I told you it would work. So, so you know what you owe me now, Charlie? A dick sucking. Well, yes, but that comes later. No, no. What, uh, what you owe me is a big, wet, sloppy. You were right, Alex. Alex, come here. Let me give you a nice, big, sloppy, wet ki um, lick. And I will say Fuck you. Fuck and I will you. Gladly say it. Here is one nether cube for you. One is going in this chest for me. Holy shit, you're condensing. <laughs> uh, made a, I made four, yes. Oh, okay then. Well, I'll go put this one in the condenser I have upstairs. Upstairs? What yeah. the fuck? <laughs> I made another one. <laughs> well, this was gonna stop at nighttime though. Well, it doesn't give a fuck. I don't care. Actually, no, it's right next to the pumpkin, so it'll go here, uh, go all day long. Oh. Plus, this is just to condense nether stars anyway. Okay. Well, um, yeah, that, that's like, that's super, super key there. It really, it, at nighttime, it won't have full power, cause even with the pumpkin right here. Like, the pumpkin yeah. has to be right there for it to be full power. Either way, um... Can't think of what I was going to say. Um... Something about horse butt. I don't know. Very possible. Uh, make a beacon, and we will make a pseudo division sigil. Very well. Get, get your ho get your ass down there, ho! If I could ever find a ladder, I will. Ladders for bitches? Can I have my shovel back, by the way? What shovel? The one I gave you earlier. What shovel? What'd you do with my shovel, bitch? I didn't do nothing with your fucking shovel, ho. You and your ho shovel. Hey. Did you just flint and steal that? Yes, I did. <laughs> Charlie, you forget. I'm too much of a god now for you to touch me. <laughs> I'm gonna finish eating. Now, what shovel are you talking about? Give you a steel shovel, are they? Uh, check the ender patch. I don't know what you mean. There ain't no shovels. Just... Yeah, there is. There was, anyway. You just hung it up. <laughs> uh, make a beacon real quick. I will find our division sigil. Charlie, you need to stop being a bitch, Nugget. I mean, if you want to make a pseudo division sigil today, you need that beacon. Well, you just hold your little shit in because one thing at a fucking time, Charlie. Yeah. One thing at a fucking time. I'm going to look up go ahead and look up what we need to make it completely so fuck damn it we are out of glass again pseudo division sigil make a beacon without any goddamn <laughs> glass there sand that'll work 
formed in the end dimension, it is highly advised to defeat the dragon prior to starting the ritual, but not necessarily. The ritual is performed by placing a beacon in, a, in the center of a flat area, at least 11 by 11, not necessarily in stone, then place a chest in each of the cardinal directions, leaving four spaces empty between the chest and the beacon. In each chest, insert these specific items. So, what you're fucking telling me is... We gotta go to the end. Yep. <laughs> Charlie, you as dumb as hell. You know, you don't read these things ahead of time. Know what else is gonna be hard to do? Get diamond ore, coal ore, iron ore, gold ore, emerald ore. You have a silky gem, jackass. You're right, I just gotta find this shit. And we may actually have an emerald ore still. Um... Horse shit. Well, at least now I'm able to make. At least now I'll be able to, ma able to make four beacons. Uh, okay, so one of the four chests requires the 12 vanilla music disc, and the other one requires 12 of the 62 vanilla potions with actual effects. What chest? The third chest. What what chests are you talking about? Though? Okay, to activate the the division sigil. To make the pseudo inversion sigil, which is just the stable division sigil, you go to the end. You find the 11 by 11 spot, a flat area. Has to be, has to be flat. Okay, you know what? Fuck that shit. We're doing it without the pseudo inversion sigil. It's not worth it. I'm going to have more fun watching you explode while you do it anyway. I think you think I'm not good at this. You aren't good at this. I don't fucking know who the hell told you. Hey, you know what would be a wise thing we could do? What? What if we already had the recipe put into the, um... Uh... Crafting table using any eye? Because it has to be a normal crafting table, unfortunately. So we can't, we can't even use, like, the special ones. Yeah... Okay, well, I'm making a normal crafting table for us. So, what do we need to uh, make this shit again? Uh, I'm... We, we need a bunch of compressed cobblestone first off. So, I have okay. 11 double compressed cobblestone. So, what we really need is a shit ton of cobblestone. Each one of these actually have EMC, believe it or not. So... I made it into compressed cobblestone. So do we have enough compressed cobblestone? Uh, I'm making right now double compressed cobblestone in the generator. What we need is a... So let's see. Let's see. Let's go to the deep dark real quick. Oh, deep space dark. So it requires four quadruple compressed cobblestones. And one quintuple, which is eight, right? Yeah. What about the unstable ingots? Though? It only requires four of them. How do we make them? Uh, divide by diamond. Uh oh. So we need to make four unstable ingots. Yep. At once. them in the crafting grid and if you fail we'll have to divide more diamonds yep so we're gonna need two crafting tables yep okay so that's triple wait a minute i think i might have just realized a trick what okay you Make the divide by diamonds, and I will have 
have the other crafting grid open. Isn't it true that when two people are looking at a crafting grid and somebody's already using it ahead of time, you can see what they're working on, right? No, that's only for the more advanced ones. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, let's test it, test it. How are we testing this? Okay, look, I just placed a crafting grid behind you. Do you see 64 sand in the middle slot? No, do you see some quadruple compressed cobblestone in the middle slot? Unfortunately, Alex, I've 